Hey guys, it's Polly. Welcome back to another video. And today we have Spider-Man 2 Secrets and Easter Eggs. This video was supposed to be out a long time ago, but I never had the time to finish it. But here we are, and let's get started. So first of all, obviously all the movie suits from the live action and animated movies, they all made their way into this game. Which doesn't really count as an Easter Egg, but it's a given. But it's pretty cool to play around and swing in these suits. Now speaking of suits, there's also two superhero suits for Miles. There's a Wolverine suit and a Black Panther suit. Now speaking of Black Panther, if you go to the Wakandan Embassy as Miles, you can go up to it and do the Wakanda Forever thing. Now for this easter egg, I'm gonna just let it explain itself. Huh? Uh, how am I supposed to get out of here? I just want to tell you how I'm feeling. Damn it. Gotta the make office. you understand. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Okay, gotta go. Now this one's just an audio Easter egg, but these guys filming a Spider-Man movie, they say something about spectacular okay. Spider-Man. <laughs> Now, again, it wouldn't be one of my Spider-Man videos if I didn't mention Bonesaw slash Crusher Hogan. Obviously, Crusher Hogan isn't the same name as Bonesaw, but they're the same character. Now, all the spider drones that you collect around the city, they all have unique designs based on different versions of Spider-Man or Spider-Man characters. And, yeah, each of them. Now, speaking of the spider drones, once you collect the last one, you've got to go into this alleyway. Once you get there, a portal opens, just like in Spider-Verse, so it, it connects the game to Spider-Verse. I thought that was really cool. What the hell is happening? <laughs> Look at this, a spider hero. We were all saved. Um, I? Or you? Me? I'm just a bartender who does favors for people every now and then. And I've learned that rogue spider bots are dangerous and bad for business. Let me take those off your hands. Whoa. Thank you, Spider-Man. We can always count on you to do the right thing. You're welcome. And if Miguel comes looking for these, tell him finders keepers. Wait, who's Miguel? <laughs> now this wouldn't be a Spider-Man game with two Spider-Mans without, of course, the pointing meme. That makes its way into the game. <laughs> Now there's a few buildings and landmarks that, you know, represent certain things. The first one is the Avengers Tower. This one's a given, it was in the last two games anyway. But yeah, the Avengers Tower is still in Spider-Man 2. There's a few other locations. There's the Sanctum Sanctorum, which makes its way into this game. A rooftop with an unfinished Fantastic Four logo on it. And of course, the... Ghostbusters Firehouse, which is actually in New York. thing about that is if you go to the back, there's a ghost painted onto the back of it, so that's pretty cool. Now this last easter egg isn't really an easter egg, it's more of a brand deal, but if you go into Times Square, there's an Adidas store full of, you know, different Adidas clothing items and shoes. I thought that was a pretty cool detail. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below, suggest 
you know, other games I should cover in this series, because this is probably my favorite type of video to do, so if you have any ideas, let me know. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.